Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Mobby, and today I'm going to show you some gameplay of my first reaction, thoughts, slash review of Synthetic. Now, thank you so much for the developers for letting me get a key to play early. This game is out today as of March 15th, so please check it out if you are interested. Anyway, let's get started. So this is the opening screen right here as soon as you jump in the game. This game is a top-down roguelite shooter so let's go ahead and check out what we got in the options before we get started here uh we can check out okay, okay lots of good video settings window mode of course alt enter and it uh, looks like everything here is looking pretty good muzzle flash effect show damage show player two damage looks like this game is multiplayer feels good man open weapon on menu all right look at this oh we can cheat for fun if you guys want which is pretty cool port fort settings master volume down here music settings okay and you can key bind the thing Okay, oh, well, let's actually look at the key binding, see what's actual. Oh, we can change a lot of stuff. Looks like this game, you can play with a controller, gamepad work in progress. Uh, I think for today, we'll do a uh, mouse and keyboard, of course. Alright, so hopefully, I don't have to memorize all this right now. <laughs> there better be an in-game tutorial. So, welcome to the lab. The lab allows you to unlock many varied things that persist between runs. So, if you guys never played any roguelikes, it's a game where... It's pretty much like small sessions of gameplay where you go in, things are always different for the most part, whether it be like, you know, uh, whatever drops for you to use, armor, weapons, items, and then sometimes enemies are different in random areas and the layout. So it's one of those genres which is very dear to my heart. I love this type of thing, you know, Binding of Isaac. There's tons and tons and tons out there. So, okay. So click start when you're ready. So this is us. We are a guardian class, I believe. So it looks like we can spend some money. What's all this stuff? Multiplayer. You. It says unlock that lab level two. Um, I guess we just keep playing. So multiplayer classes, difficulty, research, item database, and weapon database. Oh, pretty awesome here. So it requires this X, which is money, I suppose. On the bottom left, you can see here I have no monies. So we start with this pistol, and then what's this? The core class memory module kills and damage taken increase to combo. Okay, so more combo the better. So here we have our loadouts. Looks like there's lots of extra stuff we can add here. So we have, looks like we have three slots. Let's just see what we are taking with us. We have a basic gun, a stun grenade. Let's see, stunning all enemies, removing shields. Auto taser. Um, fires a taser projectile on a weapon slot after slight delay. And then we got methadone. Grants heavy damage resist and health regeneration for all team members. And the iframe. Taking damage over 100 grants, uh, one second of immunity. Okay, let's get started. So I don't know how to play this. Uh, this is my first time ever opening up. So let's begin. Ready. I'm ready. Oh my god, we're gonna die. Uh, okay. Listen, Synthil. Enter. Okay. I have watched you a hundred times with great amusement. Your betrayal is admirable. Sir, be praised. But I haven't started my mission. Okay, so we're playing as the android. It seems. But this is but one timeline. Dot, dot, dot. I am not here to chat. Your stagnation has become dull. This is the god of war, sir. My god. Therefore, I decided to grant you transcending consciousness. Make use of your knowledge. Be thanked, sir. Zer. <laughs> Be thanked, sir. Alright. Oh, cool. Look at this. Okay, so I don't know how to play. Okay, looks like... Okay. Your shield absorbs incoming damage. We have shield here, HP. Okay. WACD to move. Alright, alright, got it. Weapons increases. Okay, this is the system heat. I'm gonna sneeze. I'm gonna mute myself there. Keep heat below critical levels. Okay, so it overheats. Ooh, so far I like the, um... Right off the bat, I have to say I really like the graphics of this thing. Okay, so... Oh, is there a reload system? So that's my gun right here. What's this? Core and iframe. Okay, so this is the heat, so you don't want to overheat. I'm pressing R to reload, looks like that isn't it. Okay, let me hit... Okay, E reloads, okay, E, R. Oh, looks like... Oh, did you guys see that? Wasted ammo. Um, well, when I'm reloading, there's a little uh, quick time event thingy. Messed that up here. Let's try that again. Okay, so if I shoot, 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 and then I discard my ammo... Ejecting your ammo realistically consider okay. Okay, so I don't know what happens if you use up your bullets I'm not sure how much okay, so I'm gonna press R and then time it. I don't know if I got that right or not. Okay, let's go Okay, so I don't know is there instructable instructable environments. I'm not sure 
So I'm glad they have a tutorial zone here. Oh, right, there you go. There you go. I did that. Okay. Oh, this is cool. Target test. Um, okay, it's going away before I can read. Eliminate targets. Perform headshots. Headshots? So I can shoot the... Oh. What the hell? What is this thingy? Okay. Ooh, ammo. Oh, yeah. We got 200 ammos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, then 206. There you go. I wish this thing would stay persistent here. I didn't know that was my ammo here. Okay, so... Pew! So, I don't know. Okay, so shooting in the legs, shooting him in the head. Looks like it does matter where you aim, I suppose. See, I'm shooting him on the leg. And then you can aim at the... Aim at the head? Interesting. Very interesting. All right. So, let's eliminate one more target. Interesting. Okay, so you definitely don't want to reload whenever you have zero. <laughs> you definitely want to get more. Okay, let's get some more ammo. Okay, um, there are many active and passive items you can find. Use non-passive items with one through nine. So, is this my one? Stun grenade. Yeah, this is going to be my one, I suppose. So, stun grenade. Yep, that's it. And then two is going to be this one, auto taser. Damaging. Eh? Uh, no? Monka giga. Okay, press X to inspect my weapons. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff going on here right now. So this is showing my weapon here. I'm assuming you can, like, customize it later on and stuff like that. Use shift and middle mouse button the dash. Okay. Where's my dash thingamabob here? Okay. Look at the top there. We have a minute to complete the challenge. Headshots, kills, etc. God, everything's moving way too fast. I'm trying to read everything out. I jammed it? Oh, your weapon jams? I guess there's a slight chance for that. Okay, activate reload hits bars. Okay, hold up. Let's just get some uh, nice shooting practice going on here. Pa, pa, pa. Pa, pa, pa. Pa, reload and time it. Pa, pa. Okay, so far so good. Getting a good feel. I'm glad that they throw you directly in this little tutorial thing, which is very nice for you to get used to the game. I was afraid, like in the menu, it looked like it might not have done that. Okay, we got to get a two more kills in ten seconds to finish this little challenge. No problem. Oh, done. We did it. We got a new weapon here. It seems. Okay. Oh, look at that. We're using the Spaz 12. It's a semi. Looks like it's a shoddy. Jesus Christ, sickles. Okay. The top here it says L enter the teleporter by following the red arrow, yellow arrow when ready. And then it alerts left enemies in the level. Let's obtain more items here. We found another item here, the key vector. So how do we, oh, you could swap between, oh, you can swap. That's cool. Look at that. That's very nice. So how many do we have? We have the pistol. We have our, that one. And we have this, oops, we have this. How do I just do? Uh, how do I look at my items again? Feels good, man. Yeah. Okay. Seems good. Okay. Everything's good? What's this? Idle? Charging? Charging what? What's happening? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What's going on? Find and destroy the heart of armor again. So we're throwing us right in the game again. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. Let's do this. I'm ready. What's this? Standing perfectly still while firing is point for most weapons. Perfect your stop and go movement to fire accurately. Okay. Especially with pistols. All right, let's do this, boys. Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Well, it's kind of hard to stand still, and enemies are going to shoot you, huh? Okay, so that was a little ammo thing I picked up, I guess. So we have to eject and then reload. Okay. Okay. Interesting. I wonder if I'm immune while dashing. Probably not, huh? Okay, so I think you can, you can use these to can blow, you can blow these up, probably. Oh, my God. Look at all. Do I get stuff from boxes? So I'm not sure. Okay. So you can see here over my reticle, when I'm moving, you can see how large it gets. So, it, so so that shows you my accuracy, which is pretty nice. So it seems like as long as I'm... Oh, look at that. Yeah, yeah, look, look. It shows you. That's pretty cool, actually. I like that a lot. Okay, let's get one. I'm going to throw a stun grenade. And then we're going to fire at him. Oh my god. Jammed. Oh my god, a weapon jammed. Okay, so I don't want to stand still, so I guess I'm going to kind of like move <laughs> right now holy crap I'm not gonna lie the graphics are very beautiful but right now it seems like it's really hard to see what the heck's happening on the screen um, but so far I think I'm doing an okay job dodging enemies 
I think we should uh, switch over to our pistol until we can get used to what all the enemies' bullets look like as they fly towards me. Because in bullet hell games, it's very easy to get kind of lost, you know? Like, I, I can't tell half the time if enemies are shooting at me. Well, we'll find out. Okay, okay, not bad. Gotta reload. Okay, let me throw that grenade. So far, so good. Oh my god, this weapon's very hard to do any good damage with. Alright, so as we play, we'll find out which enemies actually... Oh my god! Yeah, we'll, we'll find out which, which enemies actually attack us melee and all that stuff. What did I just pick up? Upgrade kit! Improves a weapon. I don't know how to activate that. Oh, here it is. Increases the power of currently held weapon and allows the building... Okay, so can I activate this now? Four. Oh, okay. So because I have... Oh, I can, I can upgrade. Okay, let's upgrade my pistol. Why the hell not? Uh, pick one, huh? Caliber reduction. Increases magazine at the 15 damage. Ooh. Increased fire rate. What's this? Titanium rifling. Increased maximum travel distance. And every four kills increases maximum health until 15 is reached. Wow, that's that's actually cool. So fire rate went up a little bit no matter what. And every four kills gives me more permanent HP, I would assume. Interesting, very interesting. All right. Let's see what we got here. So our goal here is to get through every little... What's this? Exit? Is there an exit up there? Boom! How about that? So I wonder if there's going to be like a little... Ah! Like a stealth thing going on here. Okay, let's, let's, let's practice moving and shooting at the same time. Okay, I got to... Okay. Not bad, not bad. What did I just pick up? That's ammo there, huh? Okay. I also got to uh, work on dodging. Let's do that. Shift. I'm going to use shift instead of middle mouse. I don't like using middle mouse to do, like, dodging actions. Okay, so I think this little circle guy... Look at that. You have to shoot in advance to see where enemy is moving. So this game does take a little bit of skill, <laughs> obviously, which is nice. Shields down. All right. So we're getting kind of hurt. Looks like the shield regenerates. Okay, that's good. What's that here? Item. Okay, not bad. I wasted ammo. What the hell am I doing? I'm just so used to reloading after every, like... You know, shot. You freaking spoiled me in Call of Duty and shit. Stuff. Chaos Potion. Unstable or heal. Heals or damages. But it can never be fatal. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? That's insane. That, I wonder if I want to use that. Okay, let's keep going. Jeez, auto taser. So, this thing is auto. Fires a taser on a weapon shot after slight delay. So, so this is what this thing is, right? This little guy, I believe. Okay, where do I go now? Exit. Exit, exit, exit. Where's the exit? Do I leave now? The way it came? Or something? I don't know. NA, not available. Okay. Oh, okay, I see it. So I think there's a little arrow. Yep. There's a little exit on the top left, a little arrow showing me where the exit is. That's cool. I wish there was a small little indicator telling me where the cooldown of my dash was. Maybe I'm just blind and can't see it. But after I dash, it doesn't seem like it shows me anything. Okay, let's keep going, boys. So far, so good, though. You know, so far, so good. What's that? Jesus! Okay, this guy does have a shield, but screw it, man. It looks like we still do damage. Jammed. Doof, doof. Come on, bruh. Get away! Okay, not bad, not bad. I just want to use the pistol for a bit. I know I have these other weapons that are crazy, but uh, I just want to get used to using like this little weapon here. Oh my god, I didn't dodge. Okay, so far so good. Let's go. Mm. What's this? Oh, just a bunch of ammo. Alright. Let's practice dodging. Oh, okay, that guy's not attacking me. I wonder how good a control would feel, you know, using the twin stick. I don't know how good it'll be because I don't know. It's just like when, whenever it, Jesus Christ. Okay, hold up, hold up. I'm using my weapons here. This is crazy. I can't even tell what's happening. All right, but I think we're we're surviving. We're surviving. All that matters. Okay, we stunned him. We stunned him. Stunned him. I gotta use the stun as much as possible, man. I mean, like it, it's it's only on a cooldown. I should use it, especially when there's clusters of enemies, right? Dodged 390. Excuse me. There's some health right there. 
Okay, what's my maximum health at? 1325. I think it was 1200, so it is going up. Oh, God. Rapid firing pistol hurts. Okay. Okay. Methadone. How much of these do I have? I used one as soon as I got caught. What's this? This looks like, this looks awesome. Body upgrade, body upgrade, dodge up, luck up, 5,000 experience. Body up, dodge chance. I mean, why wouldn't I want that, right? What the hell? Oh my gosh. Eject, reload. Hey, they want me to like not move when I'm attacking, but god dang, I don't want to get hit. Okay. Is that an enemy? Now that little drone thing? What's this? Oh, this is a shop! Heat seeker, purchase, yes or no? 1200 CR. I don't have 1200, I believe on the bottom left it's 888. So I'm gonna no? Uh, oh, Jesus! Ah, oh, come on, man! Come on, man! You know what? I'm switching over weapons for just a bit. Oh my god. Shut up. One, two, three. You don't have a lot of here. I'm interested in what that heat seeking thing will do. Okay, so you have to keep track of how many shots you have, and you don't even have to like look at the um, your magazine. As long as you keep track, I have six shots. Five, six. And so you can focus on dodging, so you don't have to move your freaking vision all the way down there, you know? Jeez. All right, I'm getting a good feel for this game. It's pretty, pretty good so far. <laughs> God, <sighs> methadone. So this thing has increased damage. Methadone. Oh my God. One, two, three. Poo, 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 poo. Okay, we have two left. How do we get more charges on that? Is it just an item pickup? I don't know. Okay. Let's switch over to uh, my auto right auto machine gun here. My little submarino. Okay, we got we got the exit now. Chaos potion, dude. I'm scared to use this thing. Oops, I used it. Oh, that was plus 200. Between 700. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know if I want to use that. I guess we'll use it if we absolutely need to. Mm. Yeah, so far so good. Yeah, I'm enjoying it. Enjoying it. Oh my god, this thing runs out so fast. What are these things above me? Holy crap! Jesus! Oh my god, this is insane! Jammed. Oh god. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So far, so good! So far, so good! Oh my god! There's so many bullets! So many bullets! Oh god. It w this wouldn't be much easier with the second player, obviously. And I'm pretty sure that you can play online and it's not just local, so... Like, it's always nice to have roguelikes that you can play with friends, you know? Like, Binding Isaac did have that small little multiplayer thing that no one really did. <laughs> and then, what was that other game? The one that was really small sprites that allowed you to play with other people. I forgot the name of it. Oh, boys. Oh, God, this is insane. Okay, looks like my methadone or whatever, it reloaded. Oh, my God, I'm out of ammo? Sorry guys, focusing just a little bit here. Oh my god, what the hell are these things? Which enemy is doing that? Is it this guy? No, he's dead. One of these enemies are throwing this- is it you? I don't know. Oh my god, I'm missing so hard. You have to like really slow down, otherwise your accuracy just garbo. Okay, it's not this guy. Oh my god. Has to be someone I passed up earlier. What's this? <clears throat> it's this thingy. It's gotta be that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It has to be. What are, what are these? God, just fire. Just fire. Okay. Oh. Jammed. Okay, come at me, bruh. I'm gonna heal. Woo. It healed me a little bit. I wonder what the chances of healing there are. Order 42. Oh no, close to dying. Okay. 
Wow, this game is really intense. I'm gonna heal. Plus 300. Cool, we got lucky with our chaos potions. Oh, med! What happened there, huh? What did we get? Did it just heal us all the way? Okay, I guess so. Cool, very cool, very cool. This game's intense. Scanning! Scan these nuts! Got him! Dude, I can see the skill level on this game. Extremely high skill cap, dude. Definitely can be- Oh! Definitely can be for hardcore players. I just don't know, like, how far the game goes yet. Usually in roguelikes, you get at least some sort of indication, like, Oh, 900 floors you must beat. I don't know exactly what floor I am on or anything like that. Like, I, it doesn't... What's this? Upgrade! Spend uh, some credits to upgrade my, uh... This? Okay, so what, what is it? What did it do? Item power, 94. I can upgrade again? Okay, I don't know, like how good this upgrade is for my for my thingy here like maybe it, it stuns them for longer maybe it has a higher aoe i'm not sure but i upgraded it twice i could upgrade it again but i think it's okay so i don't know if this money persists throughout the whole playthrough we'll find out right we'll definitely find out okay Oosh. god this game is challenging though oh my god Freaking going crazy. Oh, I missed. Okay. Mastery up? Look, mastery up. I can expect it. Oh. oh I left through the next area already. Alright, hold on. Will enemies leave me alone here? Okay. I don't know what mastery up means. Like, oh, look, they can get attachments. So, maybe the mastery is these little extra things right here. I don't know. Very interesting. Let's go to my machine, submachine here. Got to reload it. Jesus. Oh my god, don't you jam on me. Don't you jam on me. We're getting wrecked, dude. We're getting absolutely destroyed right now. Oh my god. So many mechanics, but it's, you know, it's pretty, pretty nice. I found an upgrade kit, boys. What should I upgrade? My machine gun? Nah, I think I'll do the, um... I don't want to do the pistol again. We'll do the shoddy. Let's actually check it out right now. Okay, here's my shoddy. Let's upgrade it. So we can use one of four. So I think, like, every one of these is probably random when you upgrade it. Okay, caliber reduction. Uh, let's see. Adds accuracy, control, but negative damage. Slightly increased max ammo, which is very useful, though. So any one of these will increase my max ammo at the moment. Uh, increases the amount of spare ammo and slightly faster ejection speed and reducer um kills reduce the cooldown of all items i think we'll go for one of these let's go accuracy control a little bit of less damage is fine let's just see how good this is you know oh my god okay mm -mm. god dang it oh my god it hurts Uh, we're gonna die. Kill them before they kill me. Times three experience and credit boost, huh? Is that a shop? This is a shop. Flamethrower, 1800. Oh, I don't have enough for that. I would love to try that out. Definitely. Okay. Pretty good for our first run. I wonder how often, you know, the average player has a run on this. Okay, I'm gonna try to use my freaking stun grenade as much as I can. Cause we upgraded it twice, we should use it. And because it, it doesn't waste, you know? Item! Face melter, explosive headshot. Explosive headshot? Sacrifice accepted. Excuse me? Headshots deal increased damage and have a chance to cause explosion. My HP is really low. Oh, it looks like you recover a little bit over time. Weapon heat, oh my god. Why is our... What did it mean by offering accepted? Did we, like, use up a lot of our HP or something for this? Methadone charge plus one. I feel like we did something we shouldn't have right now. Anyway, let's try for headshots then, I guess. I'm gonna activate my methadone here. More damage! Let's get rid of this dumb thing. Oh, getting messed up, boys. 
We're getting messed up. All right, this is fine. Okay. Oh, oh, I missed this ammo here. I wonder if it disappears. I don't know. Scan these notes. Did I say that already? I feel like I said that already. Am I out of ammo? I'm out of ammo. <laughs> I switched over to my sub and it freaking... What's this? Is that an elite? He had a skull over him. Oh my god, I'm blind. I can't see. I can't see. Oh my god. Oh. <gasps> Ah! Accuracy! Whew! Interesting, very interesting. Alright, that's the exit. Let's see if there's anything to buy or anything like that. I don't know if it's necessary to kill most enemies, you know? I don't know if we get experience. I mean, I'm pretty sure you get credits for killing an enemy. Oh my god, I'm so close to dead. Yeah, yeah, you definitely get credits, so I guess you do maybe want to just kill all the enemies. But let's move on to the next area. Dude, I don't know how I like is it just survival like is there is there no end here that's the thing Whew. I mean I guess we'll just keep going till we die we'll definitely just keep going oh my god it's so hard to shoot anything with this I need to upgrade this gun next maybe get um, some sort of accuracy buff or something shields down uh, I'm gonna die no, 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 not like this, not like this. What is this, shop? Accept quest, yes. Uh, intoxicate the area, open valves. Okay. Mini quests in between, so it's not just all straight out killing, which is nice. I like that a lot. Very cool, very cool. Okay, so as the exit, we don't want to leave yet. We want to open the valves. So, maybe I can just run to the very ends, you know? Oh my god! Boys, health critical, health critical, hiding. Methadone, activate! Oh, no bueno! No bueno! Oh god, this is it. Run! Come on, mobs, you can do this. Oh, snap! Very close. We healed up, shield back. That was a very hairy situation. That was pretty bad. Oh. Okay. Oh my god. That was the closest I think we ever had to a, a death right there. Hello, shop? Hold on. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Switch over to my pistol. So I think I also run out of pistol ammo, too. Like, what happens if I run out of all ammo? It's GG, huh? Oh, <laughs> accuracy while moving. Garbo. Such garbo. But that's why they tell you don't move, huh? Okay, what do we got? Some health. What's this? Oh, my God. Boom, 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 boom. As we go on. This thing doesn't count as headshots, huh? Anything on here? What's this? Upgrade. Oh my god, I upgrade my pistol? You can just straight out use money to upgrade. Okay, hold on. Let's, let's get these guys out of here and then we'll upgrade our pistol. Right. Pistol's nice, you know? Very nice and basic. That's has good accuracy as long as you keep your fire rate down low, it looks like. Ah! I think I headshotted that guy and he exploded. Okay, let's upgrade. So I don't know like how good the upgrade is. Let's see. Damage. Fire rate went up. Max size went up. Uh, reload speed went up or uh, down. Sorry. Reload speed. I really just want to upgrade my weapons here. I'm just trying to freaking survive. Come on, man. Hold on. I guess we gotta kill all these enemies first. Oh god. It doesn't take that much money to even upgrade, you know? It's, so it's a random upgrade, it seems. Alright, that was good. So I wish, you know, it says here, like, how much I have left when I recover. I don't know if there's an option in the freaking settings to have it so it permanently stays, because that's annoying. Alright, hold on. Let me check. Let me check. Oh, looks like the game doesn't stop, maybe. Okay, let's see here. Bindings, general settings. Open, chest, show experience, show visual recoil, hide full UI now. Interface, let's see. Okay. Show total weapon, fade out weapon stash, no. Don't, don't fade out, no, don't fade out anything. I want to see all of my stuff. Show enemy ammo, only one low. Slow motion, high damage. So is that better? 
Well, no, my freaking ammo thing is still going away. I wish I, I mean, okay, it's right here. Never mind, it's right here. I'm stupid. It's right there. All right, anyway, let's look at this. Okay, so it's gonna give me a random upgrade for two hundred bucks again. Okay, looks like my reload speed increased. I'm gonna use all my all my items on here. Reload speed again. Fire rate up. Why, why did that disappear? Recoil down. Max size up. <laughs> I decked out my pistol like crazy, boys. Okay, let's go. This is my weapon of choice. What is this? There's a question mark on it. No. What the hell is that? So, the, fi the, the fire rate went up, which is nice, I guess. It's probably the best thing out of this. Okay, we'll open the valves. We got one more valve to open, which is going to be just over here, it seems. Dude, keep getting caught in the sides here. Here it is. So, we did a quest. We did a in-game quest. All valves. Hundred th oh, we got a thousand experience. That we have. They gave us a little bit of credits, too. Look at that. We got a random reward for an upgrade kit. I'm upgrading my pistol again. Digitizer. Bullets are directed towards the recoil center. Increasing accuracy. Low. Um, so everything's going to reduce recoil. Um, bullets always ricochet. That sounds really good. Impact CPU. Reduces the heat generation. And regen increases. Let's do this one. So. Ooh, it bounced. Yeah, that's really awesome. I want to upgrade my gun again. Another random upgrade. Okay, here we go. Max size up by two more. That's, that's, that's very awesome. Ooh, 20. I love this. This is cool. This is cool. Right, let's get out of here. I used up all my credits on this. So I'm assuming like probably all of the upgrades I do is not permanent. It's probably only for the run. But then you may be able to do some later on. What's this? Danger. Boss? Oh. Uh-oh. Ah, ah. All right. All right. Does this work on it? Holy crap! I'm gonna die. I'm I'm going to die. I, I this is it. Just gotta just gotta kill before he kills me. Kill before he kills me, boys. Oh, his health is on the very top. The spans the whole bar. Oh, come on, come on. He's almost dead. He's he's halfway dead. I'm just using my pistols. Empty. Oh um, no, 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 come on, come on, come on, sorry, focusing, oh, we did it, experiment 57 destroyed, Woo! we found something called a module core, mysterious module, uh, okay, allow selecting one of multiple different class unlocks, what does that mean? Oh, okay. Bits and pieces. Each obtained plating instant scavenge increases plating. What's plating? Is that my armor? Hmm. Push forward. A active reload uh, grants a surge of moving around, which is very nice. Kills refresh maximum shield. Okay, I, I we'll do bits and pieces. We'll do bits and pieces. That sounds pretty cool. Each each obtained plating instances increases scavenging by two. That sounds good. I don't know what plating means though. Hold on, there's a bunch of ammo here. So we did it. We 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 defeated our first little major boss thingy, which is cool. All right, I like that a lot. What else do we have here? That was kind of scary. I almost died, definitely. Okay. And then we have this here, a weapon. Whoa, what did we just get? Weapons come in one of 17 variants. Changing stats or adding special effects. Finding a weapon the first time will always grant a standard variant. So this is a weapon right here. So do I switch out? Looks like you can only have three weapons. Yeah, three weapons, huh? Cannot replace starting weapon. So we have this one. Interesting. Very cool, very cool. Um, yeah, well, we'll keep the machine gun. So it looks like we can have three. So let's take a peek at this new weapon we just got. The R5000 Sudden DMR. All right. What is this kind of weapon here? Very cool, very cool. It's like purple, so it's like rare. Wow, that seems really cool. 
We'll try this out for a bit. All right, so I guess we just keep moving on, right? Let's keep going till we die, huh? This might be a long episode, boys. Ballistic silos. So we're on stage, I'm gonna guess like stage two or floor two or whatever you wanna call it. Shield boost. Here we go. Doo doo! Probably should've reloaded before all this. Oh my god. Okay. Got him. Woo! We're a dang near pro with this, boys. Yeah! Oh my god, they stunned me! I didn't see that coming. There's another weapon here. What the hell? What happened there? What? Sacrifice accepted. What is happening? Let me replace this weapon here. Uh, okay, so I just got a new weapon. It's like auto shoddy. Oh my god, an auto shoddy. Jesus, boys. That's cool. Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh my god. Oh, the mayhem. Oh, I got an upgrade module. Let's upgrade our freaking auto shoddy. Uh, attachment. 10% to not consume ammo. Yeah, that sounds great. Small chance of firing extra projectile. Increases the spare ammo. Uh, I think not consuming is pretty good because we don't have 20 left here. <laughs> yeah, there we go. I saw that. It was it stayed at 14. Oh no, we're almost dead. Oh my god, this weapon is so strong. I'm out of ammo, by the way. Oh no, you got it. Dude, this is insane. This is the best weapon I've had so far. <laughs> I wasted all my money upgrading my pistol. Feels bad, man. I found Akira Destruction. It's another item. I'll have to look at that when I'm safe. I think we're gonna die. No, 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 no. Hold up, boys. Hold the phone. Oh, no, no, no. Did we die? Too bad our character doesn't explode on impact. Yeah, we did it. Four data lost. Collect the data difficulty. New guardian. Oh, what's happening? I don't know what's happening. All right, looks like this is our old turtle bar here. Ah, so this is our experience modifiers here. All right, pretty cool, pretty cool. Oh, great, so this is our damage, our kills, accuracy, headshots, healing, I mean accuracy, come on, man. B plus for our score, not bad for our first try, boys. Wow, okay, let's see what happens on the main menu here. All right, so we unlocked multiplayer. Let's see what it looks like, so we can connect to the game servers. You can host the game, I guess you can play with friends. Here's the classes tab, Guardian, it's level three. Yeah, level three, good for beginners. We got the rogue class, a strong weapon uh, mechanics with DM and rifles. Whoa, we even change everything. Look, it even changed your, your starting items. That's really cool. What's this plus new unlock? Level up with the class grants a random module for the class. So, an uh, oh, that's cool. So let's go ahead and check this out. We have unlocked enraged for the guardian class, whatever that does. I'm hovering over, it's not saying anything. What does that mean? I don't know what enrage mean. Um, does it is it showing anything or something? Enraged? I don't know what the hell I just got. Maybe once I start the thing, it'll show me. So we got lots of cool stuff here. Commando. Specialist. Specialist. Very cool. Okay, so this is the difficulty. You can change it. You can add a lot more difficulties to increase your score for more experience and data. See, that's really cool. I like that a lot. Let's just take a, a little peek at them. So this is the okay. So this is the base one right here. 10% more enemy forces and all that good stuff. Grants better loots. Jamming, flinch, scorching. Weapon cooldown 20% slower. Overheating deals double damage. Wow. Haste. All projectiles fly faster. Deflect. Enemies have a 7% chance to deflect 80% of all incoming damage. Oh, that sounds horrible. Hardcore 1. I'm guessing it's Hardcore 2 and stuff later. I guess you unlock more difficulty modifiers too. Critical. Fragile and Dead Eye. Very nice. And then research, once we hit level four, lab level four, and then, so you have your, your your base class levels up, and then you have your other level up. That's pretty cool. And then we have the item database, which just shows you everything that you've picked up. So let's scroll through all of this. Seems like there's a good amount of stuff here. Wow, red face melter. So we, oh, I didn't even get to like use Akira or whatever. 
feeds on damage dealt to discharge a barrage of enemy uh barrage of heavy energy explosions okay and then we have the weapon database very cool so the biggest one that we want to check out is the research so yeah guys i guess that's it okay yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this little sneak peek at synthetic this is my first uh, ever first impressions thoughts and all that good stuff so let's just end by telling you what i think about the game it's pretty good um i can see that there are a lot of customizations a lot of randomness of course and a lot of skill this game is definitely going to attract a lot of hardcore players you know whether you like bullet hells or you know binding of Isaac type of games it's it's really awesome and you know i wonder what else they have ready for us i'm really interested in checking out what you can do in the weapon research facility so yeah let me know what you guys think of the game i'm gonna and stay tuned for a lot more evening with mobbies slash first impression stuff so thanks for being here thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time